my dear students how are you all i think you are all well by the grace of almighty allah welcome to NIEVS home school i am mohammad ali amin opu an assistant teacher of mathematics national ideal english version school morning shift dear students i am going to take a math class today for the student of class 2 so let's start our today's topic is ascending order it's part 2 okay this is the second class on the topic ascending order your lecture number is 9 and you have a homework today your homework number is 6 so my dear students look at the question the question is arrange the following numbers in ascending order okay so there are five numbers are given one two three four five these five numbers need to arrange in ascending order ascending order means from a smaller number to greater number okay I repeat ascending order means from a smaller number to greater number so at first look at all the digits okay zero is the smallest digit zero is the smallest digit zero is smaller than one okay and one is smaller than two like this two is smaller than three three is smaller than four four is smaller than five five is smaller than six six is smaller than seven seven is smaller than eight and eight is smaller than nine I have written all the digits. Now, my dear students, suppose there are two numbers that are given, which is single digit. Suppose four and nine is given. Four and nine is given, and we need to, need to arrange these two number in ascending order. And we know that we know that ascending order means from smaller to greater. So between these two numbers, it's nine. This one is nine. This one is four. So four is, is smaller than nine. It is very clear from this chart, right? Four is, is smaller than nine. So we, need to arrange like this 4 at first then 9 it's called arranging in ascending order okay now suppose the numbers are given the 2 or 3 then suppose 3 numbers are given the numbers are 8 6 and 7 are given and the question is arrange this number in ascending order that means we need to arrange this number in ascending order this is smaller to greater so 8 is the number is given 6 is the number is given and 7 is the number is given. So which one is the smallest? Yes, 6 is the smallest. So 6 we write down first, then we write down 7 and then we write down 8. This is our arranged number in ascending order. Okay. Now my dear students, if we have got the um, more than one digit, that means the numbers, look at the numbers. This number is how many digits are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, are, 4 digits are numbered. Okay. This number is also with 4 digits and all the numbers look with four digits okay so first of all what should we do we should identify the place value okay we should identify the place value of all the numbers that means this three is in ones place this four is in tens place this five is in hundreds place and this six is in thousands place okay like this this eight is in ones place nine is in tens place five is in hundreds place and this seven is in thousands place Again, this zero is in ones place, this zero is in tens place, this third zero is in hundreds place, and this five is in thousands place. So on, it's zero is in ones place, zero is in tens place, five is in hundreds place, and this nine is in thousands place, okay? Like this, this zero is in ones place, this three is in th hundred, sorry, tens place, this four is in hundreds place, and this four, eight is in thousands place, okay? Now, we have already seen this one the all the uh, numbers had the highest position digit is thousands okay that means the highest place values position is thousand in all the numbers so we should look at only the thousands place okay because when we arrange any number in ascending order or in descending order we need to arrange with the look at the highest place values digit okay so highest place value here all the digits has highest place is thousands so we should look at the thousands place okay in the thousands place the first number has six in the thousands place second number has seven in the thousands place third number has five is in the thousands place the fourth number has nine is in the thousands place and the last one fifth number has eight is in the thousands place now we need to arrange it from a smaller to greater okay write down in ascending order ascending order okay ascending order now my dear students which one is the smallest six seven five nine and eight we can identify here six here we have six okay six then seven we have seven 
Then we have 5 is in the thousands place, we have 9 is in the thousands place, and we have 8 in the thousands place. It's very much clear that 5 is the smallest digit among these 5 numbers. So 5000 will be our smallest number here. So 5000 will be at first place in this ascending order. Okay. Now it is done. The next number, that means this is already done. The next number will be 6 in the thousands place. Which number is 6 in the thousands place? This one, the first number is 6 in the thousands place. That means 6543 will be our next smallest number. Okay. So after 5000, our number will be 6543. It will be 6543. Now we will give the cross sign here because it is already written. Now, which number comes after 6? It is 7. We have 7 also in the thousands place. And which number is 7 in the thousands place? This number is 7 in the thousands place. That means our next number, our third number in ascending order will be this number is 7598. Write it down. It's 7598. Okay. And we will use the cross sign here. Now we have remaining only two numbers are there and both the numbers has the highest place value is thousands okay and this two number has nine and eight is in the thousands place between these two thousands place eight is the smallest because eight is smaller than nine eight is smaller than nine that's why eight thousand four hundred thirty will be our next smallest number okay so you should write down in the next line you can write down it's eight thousand 430 is our next smallest number and we should cross sign under this number and only the remaining number is 9500 so this will be our biggest number among the given numbers so this will be in the last place that means 9500 will be our last number this is our answer my dear students so first of all we need to do what we need to identify the place values in the top of this all the numbers then we should identify which place value is the highest place value on that number okay and that place values digit will be marked and that digit which digit will be smallest that number will be our smallest number okay i think you have understood many students and you have a homework today also you have a homework your homework number is six and this is your homework this is your homework question arrange the following numbers in ascending order okay only do this one is your hw as your hw only do this one the first number is 8001, second number is 6450, third number is 5000, 5, its fourth number is 10,000 and the last one is 6364. This is your HW. Please do your HW in your assigned HW copy and you can submit all of your HW in every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. See you again inshallah in the next class. Till then, Allah Hafiz.